The Office of the Attorney General has informed a parliamentary committee that tools for Humanity U.S. and German companies were conducting data mining business in Kenya through WorldCoin illegally. Attorney General Justin Muturi revealed that tools for Humanity and WorldCoin have never been registered as foreign entities at the Business Registration Service under the Office of the Attorney General to conduct business in Kenya and therefore lacked the Certificate of Compliance. Um, indeed, uh, tools for humanity, whether the USA or the German branch, are not registered chair. With, uh, uh, they are not in the database of the BRS. We are cognizant that they may have used deceptive marketing practices because uh, citizens were not fully informed that what that spherical device was going to do was, you know, take your entire image, your entire face, and not just your eyeball or iris. Do you think probably? Uh, there can be some form of interaction, maybe even a, a, you know, an online system, an online system where if, if maybe all a requirement from ODPC that before they give uh, this, this certificate, then they should ask for a certificate of compliance from, 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 from BRS. The onus is really on the foreign company that comes to our borders and wants to conduct business here. So you're supposed to, to do everything you can to comply with Kenyan law. You're supposed to go to BRS and uh, apply. Under Section 974 of the Companies Act of 2015, a foreign company shall not carry on business in Kenya unless it is registered in accordance with the provisions of Part 37 of the Companies Act. One code is not registered as a company for whatever purpose in Kenya. The laws we have are not sufficient. They are